Hello everyone, welcome back to Quanta AI Lab. So today we learn about wave speed. Before we going into the wave speed or the Hunyan video, so let me do what we are doing. So we are the Quanta AI Labs, which is generative AI consultation company, or we provide educational training in generative AI tools or software. So if you have any query, you can click on this number or contact us on this email. So let's go into the wave speed comfy UI node. This is the comfy wave speed. It increased the speed of every uh, workflow which you are doing. For example, you are using Flux. They are, they are taking a lot of time. So this will increase your speed. If you don't believe on this, just go to the comfy UI. Let's go to the comfy UI and see. So this is the Hunyan video we are using. Uh, so we talk about this uh, Hunyan video. A model in the last video for example if you did, didn't watch that one you can watch I, I put the link in the description this is the workflow here we use ggf model so and this is the dual clip you need this a uh, clip lava so where did you find all this thing you can go to manager uh, let's go to clips uh, union. Union, if you write union so there is the diffusion model you can find if you have uh, more than 24 GB VRAM you can use that or if you don't have you can use GGF models there is a VA you can download this one this is the clip you can download that one also or FP16 also is there so you can download directly from here on the from the manager if you need custom node just go to custom node and click for waves If you search waves, okay, so it is not coming here. You need to download from directly this GitHub profile. Okay, so how you download from here? Just open a Jupyter Labs, uh, something like that. This thing. Open the terminal. Let's me open the terminal. Go to. We are in the model folder right now. You need to go to custom nodes. CD custom notes. CD custom notes. You can click on tab, you can get the custom notes. CD custom notes. We need to go in this folder. Okay. Or you can update your comfy you got into the manager all. Okay. So once you are coming there, just go to this one. Code, copy this one. Now just go to the your Jupyter. Right. Get clone and paste that link and enter when you enter this thing it's it will download in your custom node folder okay once it is done go come to comfy ui just restart the system and refresh from here you got the uh, your this apply first block cache so you can add in any workflow for the majorly for the flux so they are taking a lot of time in image generation also so you can add this one where you need to add so after the model you need to add this one you need to connect this one then you need to do add lora or something like that okay so this is the va i already saw you how to download the va also and this is the clips so this one you find the clip I you can found it here. Wait, let me show you this one also. Okay, this is the one, the comfy anonymous clip I. This is the one clip. Okay, once all set. If you see this is the LoRa we are using. So this one I put the link in the description, arcane style. So you need to download this LoRa. And put it into the LoRa folder. This here, you need to put it in the Lo in the mod Comfy models. Then LoRa folder. You need to put that LoRa. Once you've done, then refresh that one. So there is the trigger word also. So you need to use while writing the prompt. This will give the prompt example also. 
So if you don't know how to write a prompt, just copy this one and paste it on the chat GPT and write a prompt. Use this uh, use this prompt and write me a prompt for different different use cases. Or you can write a complete storyboard using that. So it is on your creativity. Let's go on our major topic. So our major topic is this one: wave speed. It will increase the insanely speed. For example. Previously, it taking 15 minutes to generate a video. Now, it takes 9 minutes or 8 minutes to generate the video. Yes, previously, it takes 1 minute or 2 minutes to generate the image. Now, it takes 0. 0. 0.6 seconds to generate the image. This is insanely fast. So, there is one P cache also. I will show you in, later in the video. So, let's go to this is the LoRa we are using. This is the trigger word. So this is the Hunyan video. So I am using GGF model. It works fine with it. But you can if you have the larger VRAM. You can use with the Hunyan base model. Okay. Which, which is 25 GB. So after running all this thing. We are using sampling step 7. And guidance also 7. This is the steps. 25 steps. Okay. Now the output is this. So you see this quality is also good. It's not bad according to if. But if you are using the base model, this will increase. Okay. So this will increase the output quality also. So this is all in this wave uh, speed workflow. Basically wave speed node, custom node. And it will work with the flux also. Let me show you that one also. How to... You can add this thing with flux. Let me load the workflow. Let me check. So yeah, we load the base uh, workflow for flux. We have clip. Okay, uh, let's do this. Is clip one? We have E five X S X E five X X L F P sixteen. We don't have flux channel. Okay, we have that one also. So we can use F P eight. Okay, now we need to apply this wave speed node. So the name is apply cache. Apply first block. You can search for the wave speed or apply first block cache. Now you need to see the image speed. Okay, let me show you that also. Basically, I'm using the Jarvis AI. So they are not giving me the logs, but I will show you. So let me use 0 0.15. Is that fine? Yeah. So yeah. The one thing also. The 0 0.15 it works fine. You can go till 0 0.17. That will give us a better result. Okay. After that the distortion in the image or in the video will come. Okay. So let's run with this one. So if let's do without that. Okay. It will be much better. For us. So, okay. So there is a EA. Okay. We need to. If the VAE. We, we don't change the setting. Just run the simple. Thing. Okay. So we start. Let's see how much time it will take. So this is the process. Of which is right now going on. Okay. Okay, so it takes some uh, one minute or one minute more. Okay, so there is nothing in the prompt. Wait, let me write some prompt. Let's use this one. Let's use this one. This is the prompt. Let's run, rerun it. Okay. Okay, so we got the our image. Now let's try for with the wave speed. Okay. Uh, let me and bypass this time. Let me rerun. Okay. 
Let me be in this one. It is much faster. It generate the image. Okay, right now we are using. I think we are using fixed. Okay, in the end. Okay, that's why we are. If we generate random. Let's see. Insanely fast. It is insanely fast. It takes zero point some zero point zero six seconds to generate this image. Okay. So it will boost your speed. If you want to increase the speed of your computer workflow, you can add this one. Or there is one T cache. So let me show you all that one also. But it works much uh, good. Maybe much better. Okay, let me search the T cache and all. T cache. Okay, I come come for your T cache. You can install that one. You can use that one. Or maybe this is the T cache Hunyan video. Yeah, you can use that one. So that will that also works the same. But this this is work pretty well. So you can use that one. Increase the speed of your come for your workflow. Hope you like the video. If you like the video, subscribe our channel for upcoming videos to get the notification and click the bell icon to get the notification. Thank you everyone.